So I've seen a few people online where they have their GPUs, but they've fried the chip that controls the fan. The graphics card works otherwise, but the fans don't kick in. Uh, so the best way to fix that is you won't be able to fix the chip. Most likely the board's burned and it's wrecked. Uh, but what you can do is if you disconnect the connector for the fans, now you'll want to flip the fans over and take them out and check the voltage, but typically they're 12 volt. And if so, if you pull up the diagram for the connector, you'll see yellow and black are the power wires. This one says 5 volt, but it's typically 12, but double check yours just to be sure. And if it is 12, you can pull up the 6-pin connector diagram, and you'll see these three are 12 volt, these three are ground. So all you'll have to do is cut the wires off here and solder the yellow wire to one of the 12 volt pins, and then the black ground to one of the ground pins. And right now I've just hooked this up with uh, a little bench power supply. So you'll see if I flip this on, the fans work. Now they are a little loud because they are at full 12 volt. So if you want to slow them down, you could get something like an inline power uh, noise adapter and then put this in between and that'll slow it down to a quieter level. Or you could uh, install like a variable control, but uh, that's the best option. You won't be able to actually repair the chip just because most likely you've actually burned the board and it's not fixable. But that's how you can still use a card if it's working otherwise.